It's Monday the 10th of February and here's your evening forecast. Weather warnings in force over the next 24 hours for wind, snow and ice. Some routes could be impassable and certainly poor visibility with blizzard conditions with the combination of snow and wind. In fact, through the next few hours until 7 p.m. this evening, there are warnings out for strong gusts along the south coast, up to 70 miles an hour. And a band of rain and snow has pushed its way southwards, bringing with it the chance of one to three centimetres of snow above around 100 metres. Anywhere from the Wash through to Derbyshire Dales, as well as Greater Manchester, down towards the North Midlands. Now, these two warnings expire through Monday evening. However, there are other warnings in force right the way through to midnight tomorrow. So a combination of wind and snow across much of Scotland and Northern Ireland. Above around 300 metres, we could see up to 20 centimetres of snow with gusts up to 60 miles an hour in places blizzard conditions are likely. And then across Pennine districts, particularly over the higher routes, we could see up to around 15 centimetres of snow. So certainly the M62 will continue to be affected by this. And it's all down to the fact we've got a rash of heavy showers moving in from the west. As I said, though, through evening time, those two warnings towards the south do expire. But through tomorrow, particularly if you're traveling, it's worth keeping an eye on the forecast, particularly the local forecast, because these showers are pretty much frequent and they will fall as snow across many areas. The slow, snow line is around 100 to 150 meters, but even at lower levels to that, we could see some snow settling above that. So that's the details warning wise over the next 24 hours or so. And as you can see, they're really packing in on a strong wind but it will be a slight improvement further south and east. Still those showers across the West Country, central southern England, the wind has changed direction by then. And as you can see, we are likely to see showers pretty much across much of Wales, as well as Northern England, Scotland and Northern Ireland. So if you are traveling tomorrow morning, the risk of ice, strong winds, and also those snow showers. So it's going to be a cold start to Tuesday morning. Uh, the winds will still be blustery and strong at times. And again, poor visibility with any height associated with those snow showers. The showers will be frequent across many areas, particularly exposed to that westerly wind. So we could see some drier slots for the Midlands, East Anglia, as well as the southeast. Here, temperatures 6, 7 degrees Celsius, generally speaking, around 0, 1, 2 degrees Celsius after a frosty start significant wind chill with that wind. So that's the picture on Tuesday. Through Tuesday into Wednesday, the risk of snow showers first thing. And then notice this slight transient ridge will bring a, a quieter spell of weather to us before another system winds its way up and pushes across the UK through Wednesday into Thursday. Affected areas anywhere from the central belt southwards. So quieter conditions across the far north of Scotland, but we will see some heavy bursts of rain and also some strong winds, gales for a time with the risk of flooding. So stay tuned to the forecast. We're not out of the woods yet. This week looks decidedly unsettled and certainly very cold with some wintry weather over the next 24 hours. We'll obviously keep you posted and updated on all our social media channels.